Hey everybody, it's I Want To Be Retro. Today we're going to take a look at passing a physical GPU to a Mac OS VM in Proxmox. To get started, log into the Proxmox host either via SSH or using the web-based shell. First, we need to edit the grub bootloader to enable IOMMU. Edit the grub command line Linux default value, adding either Intel IOMMU or AMD IOMMU, depending on the host system's CPU. Then save your changes and close out of Nano. Next, we'll apply the configuration change by running the update grub command. Now we'll edit the Etsy modules file and add the four lines to enable VFIO kernel modules. With the four VFIO lines added, save your changes and close the editor. We'll continue by adding IOMMU interrupt mapping, as well as blacklisting GPU drivers so they'll be forced to use VFIO. Using the lspci command, we'll list out the attached PCI devices on the system. Scroll through the list of devices and find the target GPU that is going to be passed to the macOS VM, noting the device PCI ID. 0, 1, colon, 0, 0 in this example. Next, we need to output the vendor and device IDs for the target PCI device by passing the PCI ID to the lspci command. Then we'll write these IDs to the vfio.conf file. Make sure to update the IDs in this command with the IDs output from the last lspci command before pressing enter. We'll generate an updated inet ramfs then reboot the host system for all the changes to take effect. Once the system reboots, we need to verify the GPU is using the VFIO PCI kernel driver using the lspci command. If the GPU is not using VFIO PCI at this point, something isn't set up correctly. Troubleshoot the issue before moving forward. We're now ready to pass the GPU through to the macOS VM. Open a web browser and navigate to the Proxmox web UI and log in. Expand the target node, then select the target Mac OS VM and select hardware from the sub-navigation menu. Click the add dropdown and select PCI device, then select the GPU from the available PCI device listing. You may need to check the advanced options and play with the different settings to get PCI pass-through to work correctly. It's not an exact science. Click the add dropdown again and select USB device, then select a USB keyboard and mouse to pass through to the VM so we have a way to control it. And finally, double-click the display option and set the value to none, then click OK. With the device pass-through set up, start the VM. If the GPU pass-through works successfully, you should see video output from the GPU. If you don't, try a different combination of settings on the GPU PCI device on the hardware page. You now have a physical GPU passed through to your macOS VM in Proxmox.